everyone, it's Natalie here, and I'm filming a haul for you guys. And actually, I'm going to spit out my gum before I start filming this video. Hey guys, so today I am filming a huge haul for you guys, and I am so excited to film this. I recently went to California um, two weeks ago. I went to Santa Cruz because my best friend moved there, and then we went to San Francisco for a day, and then I went down to LA with my mom for a late birthday present. And yeah, it was a ton of fun. And of course, in California, I gotta do some shopping because California has a lot of stores that I don't have in North Carolina. And it's just California and has like every store ever on every corner. So there's just shopping at every corner. I don't know how you guys live there and don't spend all your money because I definitely would. So yeah, so I bought a ton of things in California and also just some things like throughout the past month or so. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna get into it because it is a lot of stuff. The very first store I'm going to show you guys is Windsor because you guys know how much I love Windsor. First thing that I got is this dress. It is gorgeous. So it has like two triangles up the top, you know, and then it has a open back, which is so pretty. And then it's just white and has lace at the bottom of it, which I think is so cute. And you just basically tie it with a string. And I just like how simple and like flowy it is. And I actually have pictures that I posted in this. So, you know, go check those out on Instagram if you want. Big news, I forgot to say, I started a blog, and I've said that before, I think twice, but this time it's legit, guys. I'm actually like writing blog posts, and I am also writing for collegefashionista.com. I am so, so, so excited for that. Like, oh my gosh, I cannot believe that I got chosen to write for them. So I am one of the couple girls that are writing for North Carolina State University, and that's where I go to school, and I'm just a blogger for them, kind of. I write, um, my articles go live every single Wednesday. If you guys wanna check out my first one, I will link that down below and also if you guys please 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 check out my blog it's a wordpress it's young wild and free people .wordpress.com. so i've had that one before and i used to like post pictures on there before but i never really like used it but now i'm actually going to use it i made my very first blog post two days ago and i'm about to write another one today so check that out all right now we can go back into the haul so my next dress from Windsor, I actually got a while ago, but I didn't show it in my previous haul. So I'm just gonna show it in this one because it's still online, so you guys can still get it. And all the links will be down below if you guys wanna shop them yourselves of like all the clothes that I got. Um, so yeah, it's this dress that reminds me of like 80s Miami. Like when I think of it, I think of Will Smith's Welcome to Miami song. Welcome to Miami. Don't you guys think of that, you know? So yeah, this is what it looks like. It's super pretty. It's like kind of like a mint greenish, a bright mint green, and it has the mesh at the in the middle, so it's kind of like a cutout, kind of like a crop top, and then yeah, it has this type, I don't really know how to describe it. Next dress I got is super tropical, um, it's this, I actually, my very first blog post on my actual blog, not college fashionista, was this dress, so if you guys want to check that out, it just reminds me like I am in a tropical place. It's actually a crisscross on the back. I will show you a picture because it's like unbuttoned right now or unzipped, but I don't know, like crisscrosses in the back, so it's open back too. And the next couple things that I got from Windsor are, the, are is this shirt. So it's a white plain shirt with these eyes on it. Like, aren't those kind of like, like not scary, but like, kind of whoa, like if I wore this, like you guys would not be looking at my eyes. You would be looking at these babies. <laughs> You know what, just forget that. <laughs> and I got this shirt, I thought it was so cute, and it's kind of like for the pool. Well, no, because I'm not gonna wear it just at the pool, but it looks very beachy. It's like a high neck, which I love, and it's like, kind of like clear at the top, and then um, open back again, because like I'm totally into open backs this year, and I absolutely love them. Now the next store is going to be Urban Outfitters. So I love Urban Outfitters, you guys know that. And so my first thing that I got from Urban Outfitters is this shirt. It's a very long shirt. So I think I'm gonna wear it like either as a dress or with like shorts underneath, but like in a bralette or something like that. I don't really know what I'm gonna wear it with, but I've been really loving these. Um, and yeah, so just plain long shirt slash dress. I don't really know what I'm gonna wear it with yet, but all I know is that I really like it. 
Next thing that I got is this dress from Urban Outfitters and it's another one that I'm going to wear a bralette with and it's just a plain blue dress and the material is super soft as all their materials are and then it has like a halter back so you definitely can't wear a normal bra with this. So I think I'm going to wear a bralette with it and I'm so excited to wear it because on the mannequin it looked so good and I don't know if you guys don't ever try things on in the store let me know because I don't think like I don't remember the last time I was in the dressing room I never ever ever try things on I just kind of assume they're going to fit me and most of the time they do and if they don't I go and return it later on. That I got is from Urban Outfitters obviously because all this stuff is and it is from it is from, it's from Urban Outfitters. Okay, and it's just a plain white tank top and I actually wore this with a bralette. So you guys, I'm gonna need to invest in some bralettes because I'm planning on wearing like all these with bralettes, you know? Ah, speaking of a bralette. So yeah, I bought this one at Urban Outfitters. I think it's super cute and I wore it with that white t-shirt that I just showed you. Yep, I love it. The next thing I got is this dress and it's high neck, which is, I think is really cute and I really like high necklines and it's just kind of like a skater dress I think that's how you describe it maybe not maybe I'm totally wrong but it has a high neck and I'm really excited to wear it with um like a super long necklace or like a chunky necklace or something cute from them and yeah it's just plain gray the rest of my stuff that I got is basically all black white and gray besides what I'm about to show you so the next thing I got that is not white or gray or black is actually very colorful is this it's not a kimono. I actually thought it was kimono when I bought it because I don't try things on. But it's actually one of those things where you just kind of drape it around yourself. But it's so pretty. It has this these colors at the bottom and that's enough to make me want to buy it. Just all these pretty colors. I really, really love kimonos and just these like shawls. So yeah, I thought it was super cute and it wasn't too expensive for Urban Outfitters. So that was always good. The next store I'm going to show you guys is Brandy Melville and we all know how much just everyone loves Brandy Melville, so yeah, so I got these shorts from Brandy. I really like them. I actually have them in my LA morning routine if you guys want to check that out. I'll link it down below. But yeah, they're super cute. I wore them to sleep, but I'm definitely planning on wearing these out on just chill days with like a big white t-shirt. Um, yeah, not the most fashionable, but super comfy, you guys. So these are very versatile. They can be worn as PJs or just going out comfy clothes, or you can honestly work out in them, you know? Next thing I got is this tank top from Urban Out, or not from Urban, from Brandy Melville. And it's just plain purple and has, you know, these common just spaghetti strap cropped tank tops and kind of a lowish back. But I'm pretty sure I can still just wear a strapless bra with it. Next thing I got at Brandy is this black and white striped dress and I absolutely love it. So it is just plain black and white striped all the way down and it's just tight. So yeah, nothing else to really say about that. The next thing that I got is jeans, and I didn't know Brandy sold pants, but these fit me really nice, and they're super, super stretchy. They only have two sizes in their jeans. Like, is that not a little ridiculous? Anyways, I got these pants, and they're just plain black, and they have a rip at the knee, which I really wanted some with just a rip at the knee, so I was glad I found these. They are so stretchy, so I guess they could fit a little more than two sizes, but I mean, still, come on. Next thing I got at Brandy is this shirt that says, okay, but first, coffee, you know, the typical shirt. So, yeah, I normally do not like graphic tees really that much, like the ones that have a lot of writing on them. I'm like, eh, not really my style, but I really like this one, and I figured if I don't wear it too often, I could always wear it to bed because it's, like, so comfy and, you know, coffee. So, I'm definitely going to wear this out, but I could also wear it to bed, and I could wear it with a lot of things. Just, like, on my bum it days, I could wear it. So, yeah. That's why I got the graphic tee. Then the next thing is, I actually think I'm gonna sell it. So I got this plain white shirt from Brandy and I thought I was going to return the one I got at Urban so I could wear this one instead because this one was cheaper. But then I realized this one's like a tight white shirt and it's not loose so I couldn't wear it with a bralette. So I might sell this. I'm actually selling like all my clothes on Poshmark 
um, the app so you guys can definitely check that out I sold a bunch of things already like four so not a bunch but yeah definitely check out my Poshmark because I'm selling a ton of clothes for super cheap okay. next one I'm gonna show you is free people and so this is one hat that I got from free people and it's so cute I'm obsessed with hats like I really really love these and I really like how it had the silver right here I thought that was so cute and this is also in my LA morning routine if you guys want to check that out the next thing that I got is this kind of poncho thing I really really like it I'm gonna wear it with some shorts and some booties and it's so cute so it's just this poncho and it's like blue and gray and has big sleeves on it and then it just kind of goes out like that and yeah I don't know how else to explain it but it's really cute and it was on sale so I really love this color too so they had a white and brown one of this but I loved like the indigo color I thought it was a lot prettier and a lot more unique the next thing I got at Free People is this tank top, which, oh my gosh, I love it. It is, um, so it looks like this. So it's like a high neck, but it looks like a bandeau underneath. Like, you think that you have something else on because it's, like, comes attached, but it's, at, or, like, it doesn't look like it's attached, but it's actually attached right up here. So it gives an illusion that you're kind of wearing, like, a bralette, and this is the bralette, and you're super stylish for thinking to put, put like, a high neck bralette with, like, a tank top. Like, wow, wouldn't have thought of that. Well, you didn't think of it because free people did it for you. So, yeah, I really like it. And the next store is Nasty Gal, my very first item from Nasty Gal ever. I've never shopped there. I've never shopped online, and I've never been inside the store. So it was my very first time in the store. Um, we went to the 3rd Street Promenade, and I wish I vlogged the trip, but I totally didn't because I'm an idiot. But thumbs this video up if you want weekly vlogs from me because I don't know if you guys want to watch them. So make sure you give it a thumbs up if you do want weekly vlogs so I know if you want them or not. Um, and like post a comment down below, you know. It's like one of those, that gray shirt I got from Urban Outfitters, it's like dress slash shirt. Except this one's a shirt, but I'm gonna wear it with um, shorts underneath and a tank top because it's like totally see-through and this is like super cool. Like it like opens up, like I don't even know how to describe it. It like goes all the way to the floor, but it's so cute and it's so different. I'm so excited to wear it. Next thing I got from Topshop is this denim skirt. And I know you must be thinking denim skirts are so not in, but this one is. So yeah, it's this denim skirt with silver buttons on it and it's just white and it goes out like a line type skirt. I'm so excited to wear it and I think it is so, so cute. I really like white denim. The next thing that I got is this um, tank top from a store in Manhattan Beach. I don't remember the name of it, but it was a really cute store that had a bunch of these tank tops and I got it, it says California on it and I just thought it was really cute. The next thing that I got is this tank top, or this is so not a tank top, it's a sports bra from Nike and it's just a gray sports bra that says Nike across your chest and I think it's really cute and I'm starting to work out a lot more so you know. Gotta have the right materials, I guess. If you want me to do a fitness routine, thumbs this video up too, so I know what you guys want me to film. Next, I got these leggings that are like heaven on your pants, or heaven on your legs. Like These are the most comfortable leggings I've ever tried on in my life. I'm never going to take them off, ever. Um, yeah, they're these leggings, and they're just plain black, and they're cropped, and they're like the comfiest things in the whole wide world, and I might not even like work out in them. I might just live in them, you know, just casual but yeah they're so so soft but wait there's more guys I know so first I'm just gonna start off with the shoes so I got I fell into the trap of the Burks so I have fallen under the Burks spell you guys I used to hate Birkenstocks I used to think okay and dust is flying everywhere Whew. I used to hate Birkenstocks and I thought they were so ugly and I was like ew Burks Ugh. But now I really like them, so call me a bandwagon fan, whatever. I totally am, I admit it. But I like these, so I just got these Burks, and they're just matte black, which I love, and I've actually worn them quite a bit. So yeah, I really like these, and let me know what you think of Burks, if you guys like them or not. Okay, the next shoes I got are from Target, and they are these wedges. I actually got these the day of my formal. Um, so yeah, I got these for my formal, the day of my formal, like two hours before. But yeah, I think they're super cute and they were really cheap and they're the perfect summer wedge. And I've worn them with the tropical dress from Windsor that, so you can see a blog post on these. This one is my actual purse. It's super heavy, but it's so cute. I am actually in love with this purse. So it is 
this bag from Windsor. It's a bucket bag, and I'm obsessed with bucket bags, so I don't have it tight, but I could tighten it. Like, I could tighten it like a legit bucket bag, but I don't have it tight. It is so cute. Definitely, if you want a bucket bag, just get this one. Like, it's so cheap and so cute. As for other bags, I just got this one today at Target, and it's just this backpack. I really wanted a backpack, so I wanted one that was kind of small, though. It doesn't actually look like a legit backpack that I would carry to school, so I got this one. It's super small, and I literally just got it like 10 minutes ago. And I got a bathing suit from Target. Um, so it's black and it has neon straps, and it has like more neon back straps, and I thought it was so cute. Just got some bottoms with it that match. So they just have the neon stripes on the side, so. Yep, pretty plain, but so cute. As far as accessories go, I also got from Windsor this choker, but it came in a set with this choker, this flower one, and this yin and yang one. I do not believe the yin and yang, whatever, it's the good mixed with the bad, and there's a balance. Like, I don't believe in that, but I just thought it was cute. So, yep, that's what it was. Then I got some more jewelry from Topshop, and I got this... Also, three chain necklace. I thought they were super cute and I really liked layered necklaces. Then from Nasty Gal, I got these earrings and they are just cuffs. They just go cuff around your ear, so I thought these were really cute to do. You know, I don't have any cuffs and I really, really wanted some because they are so cute, you guys. Oh, and then from Urban Outfitters, I also got this necklace. It's just a long chain necklace and it has this like pendant at the bottom and it's so, so cute. So yeah, I'm so sorry to have to rush this haul. I just don't want my camera to die before I can film an outro. But thank you guys so, so, so much for watching my videos. And leave me any requests that you have in the bottom bar below. Or in the comments below, not bottom bar. But yeah, please, please, please check out my blog. And give this video a big, 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 big thumbs up. That would mean the world to me. Um, yeah, so just let me know if you have any feedback about my blog or anything. I only have one or two blog posts depending on when I post this video. So all the other ones that are just pictures of me, those are just from before. But like my actual blog starts in the very first one with the tropical outfit. So yeah, don't judge me on the just the pictures one. But yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching my videos. And you guys mean the whole wide world to me. And if any of you guys live in New York, please let me know. Because follow me on Instagram so you kind of know where I am. So we can like bump into each other and you guys can say hi to me, you know? Because I don't know if I want to do a meetup. Uh, I would love to do a meetup. So if a lot of you guys would come, leave in the comments below if I should do a meetup in New York City. That would be awesome. But yeah, so let me know what you guys think. And I will see you guys later. And thumbs this video up, you guys. Thumbs it up. Do it. Okay. <laughs>